Hey, it's Pastor Rick, still talking about all in thinking. And I want to take you on a text that I think will help you see the power of it. If you have ever had a moment where you were struggling and you were just trying to make it and you had this embarrassing challenge that you didn't want to talk about some problem in your life you just don't want anybody to know about. Well, there's this woman in the book of Luke and she has an issue of blood and it is painful. Luke chapter 8, verse 43 says, Now a woman having a flow of blood for 12 years. I want you to pause there and think about that. Now, guys don't always understand this because they don't have cycles and they don't understand what it means to have a flow of blood, to be constantly dealing with this flow of blood that can leave it difficult for you uh, to sit down, you worry about staining, and of course there's an aroma and there's a whole lot of embarrassing elements to this. And so a woman having a flow of blood for not one year, not two years, not 10, 12 years, 12 years, I mean, she's anemic. I mean, she's struggling and who had spent all her livelihood on physicians and could not be healed by any. She's gone to every doctor, done everything she can and can't fix the problem. You ever had a problem like that? You, you did all you can do, but you still can't fix it. He came from behind and touched the border of his garment, Jesus garment. And he immediately her flow of blood stopped. She instantly dried up. It was amazing. 12 years, she hadn't felt this good. 12 years, it hadn't changed. 12 years, but now all of a sudden it's changed. Now, this is going to change her life. This is an option now. You know, marriage might not have been possible or she might not have been able to have kids. All kinds of possibilities. But now, all of a sudden, in this one flashing moment, her life has changed. This is amazing. But I want you to notice something about her. She's all in. She's determined to touch Jesus. She's determined to get to an answer. She's determined not to quit. She's going to every doctor she can. She's doing everything she can. There's two sides of this I want you to see. She's a woman who's trying everything she can try. Some of you are not trying everything you can try. You're not trying everything that's available to you. Everything. She tries everything, and then she comes to Christ, and Christ becomes that ultimate answer for her. What I like about it is her determination. I want to ask you, are you trying? Are you reaching for a miracle like she did? If you are, then you've got to have a determination. Nobody can force you to try like this woman, to be all in and focused. But some of you are not focused enough on your issues. You're allowing it to just slide by. You've got an issue you need to deal with. So let me pray for you right now. Father, I pray for those who have an issue in life. It may not be an issue of blood. It's an issue of emotional strain. It's an issue of, of pain, financial uh, burnout. Whatever it is, I pray for them today to have an all-in, get it done, deal with it mindset like this woman had. And may you bring them to a place of healing and deliverance in Jesus' name. Amen. My name is Pastor Ricky Temple. You'll be blessed. Be focused on your issues and get it done. Reach for Jesus. He'll help you out. Be blessed. I'll see you next time. My name is Pastor Rick. I pastor in Savannah, Georgia, and Overcoming by Faith Church. Love you. Bye-bye.